Hey guys, um, I fixed my mic, so I'm sorry, but I'm sorry again about the last episode. This is not me voicing over this time. This is actually me. Um, um, I'm sorry about not being able to talk last time. I didn't realize my mic was muted, even though uh, I was talking, I think I was talking to one of my friends. I don't remember what I was doing, but yeah. Um, I forgot, so, <laughs> hey, it's fun times, anyway, so, what I was, sh what I was saying last episode, everything that was pretty much important, uh, the information I voiced over, like I said, um, but in the last episode, I talked about if you guys want me to start a new game plus, because I know some of you guys like to comment under these videos, if you want me to start a new game plus on this save or my save that's 400 level 404, I can. Just tell me if you want the. Sorry, I heard some. Just tell me if you want the original save. Oop, I broke my blinds. Just tell me if you want the ori Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Just tell me if you want this save or the level 404 save uh, for a new game plus when I start it. But y you have time to think about it. Just think about it until the last episode or something. Or just comment down now. If, if you have an answer now, stop the video right now and go down and comment below. I mean it. If you don't, pause the video right now, I will know it, and I will come and find you, and I swear you will get a biggest beating ever. Anyway, I'm sorry. I'm not that violent. Um, anyway, um, just go down below and just comment what you want, and then I'll do it. If you want me to stay on this and with the new game plus, because uh, I already know that I am going to be exploring the dungeons on my other save because it, it's it's like why not like seriously I can fly through the dungeons and literally unlock every secret so I'm gonna do it on my other save so yeah anyway where we last left off was Forbidden Woods which <laughs> excuse me which the beginning part is not bad bad <laughs> Oh, excuse me again. The beginning part is not bad, bad. But as soon as you, like, get down to, um, where you encounter the first Medusa man, that's when the poison starts setting in, and that's where I will start running. I'll tell you, I'll, I'll, don't, I'll tell you. But for right now, I'm gonna slaughter every single enemy. Three hits, that's not as good as damage as I would like, but you know... I've had worse. Give me your quick silver bullets. I know you have them. Careful. Yeah, be careful right there. I have been hit by that, and that is no fun. Hit me. Okay, well, I told him to hit me. Oh, I hit him at the same time as he hit me. I kind of thought that would stop it, but you know, whatever. Oh, I know I have Molotovs. Oh, is that dog doing something smart? So it's gonna be very stupid of me? Eh! I'll come back to this area too, uh, later in the future. Your ghost. Who is throwing that at me? Oh, it's you. I'll deal with that dog in a minute. Ah. Whoa. I just phased right through him. Or he just phased right through me. That's cool. Alright. So these enemies in the beginning, like all through here, are just simple. So you can either run past them or kill them, 
Hey, twin bloodstone shards. That's what I need. And my other save. I don't think I need that, those in this save yet. Um, be careful because you can get lost. E actually. Mm, you know what? I'm going to do it. I'm just going to explore. It's like, it's like, why not? It's not going to hurt. Mm, beast blood pellet. Yeah. Those are good. I need those. I hope I can summon Henrik. I don't think I killed him, though. No, I have killed him. So, also be careful with this one, because, you know what, I'm going to just go around and lure some guys out. Hey, guys. Wakey, wakey, eggs and bakey. I hate people who say that. I hate the parents that say that. Luckily, mine doesn't say that. One shot and a one shot. I'm just that good. Alright, so... Oh, come on. Follow me. Come on. Come on over here. Hey. There's a reason I go down all around this way. If you look up. Yeah, you saw it. That spike. Whoa. Come on. Yeah, that's right. Follow me. Follow me. There you go. He didn't trigger it. That still hurt me. No, it cannot. Okay. So, what I completely forgot was this is another safe way you can go down and around. Just do not step on this. Be careful, because this does cave in. Is it to him? Oh, I hear them. So, yeah, I don't recommend going down there. Uh, that's the way to go, and I do not want to go that way. I'm going to go up here a little further. And you'll run into this guy along with a bunch of freaking dogs. Oh. It's kind of a beast, beast are you? Yes. Glory be. You know not the value you possess. But more's the pity. The hours of the night are many, and the beasts, more than I can count. A veritable hunt unending. Not even death offers solace. And the blood imbibes you. <laughs> A most frightful fate. Oh my. But... I'm willing to do you a kindness. Step lightly round to the right of the great cathedral and seek an ancient shrouded church. The gift of the Godhead will grant you strength. Yes, I'm unquestionably certain. <laughs> Not even death offers solace. Seek you the ancient, the gift of... Okay. <clears throat> So I can do that. People used to say that by get doing that, you can actually uh, access the DLC by unlocking or getting the tonsil stone. That's not true. Uh, all you need is just the um, 
Blood chest. All you need is the eye of a blood drunk hunter, a scent which is what you get after beating Victor Armonia. Just return to Hunter's Dream and it'll be right there. And you can access the DLC anytime. If you don't know how, I'll show you. Whoa. Did they get one shot in? I got one shot in. That's 24,000 blood echoes I just lost. I'm coming back for you, boy. Okay, you know what? How about instead of make, uh, of tricking my own brain into thinking I actually parried him and dodging forward, how about I stand back from him and then wait for him? Like, actually time it correctly. Because they, I, I don't know how he can just kill me in one shot. If I die again and lose him 24,000 blood echoes, I'm going to be, yeah, 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 shit. So what my plan is, is, you know what, I already killed all these guys, nah, I'm gonna take my time, no, 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 I'm not gonna rush, I'm not gonna speed run. What my plan is to unlock that first shortcut, and then come back, and spend my blood vials on points. Buddy, stop. Stop throwing that at me. Come on. Who wants me? Who wants peace of mind? You. Come on, sir. Hey, 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 hey. I said don't kill me, douchebags. And you're there. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. Stop dodging into graves. I wish. What? How? How does he hit me? I dodge out of the way and he still circles around so fast and hits me. It's not possible, dude. Go ba look back and put it in slow-mo. Actually, I might put it in slow-mo. Watch how he turns when I go around him at the last second. Watch how fast that he turns. He clipped my cape and he still did massive damage to me. That is how my freaking blood vials go, go down so fast. Seriously. It's so annoying that there's I can still get hit after getting clipped by it from the cape. The hit wall for them is unbelievable. I forgot there's no dog in there. So I gotta watch out because there are two dogs and then a seeker. Alright, come on dogs. Oh, the dog has my blood wrap. I blood it. That's good. That bodes well for me. Come here! You know what? Just... Stop! Come here! Mother freaking dogs! Dude. D why? 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 They move... These enemies move... So much, and it's like, be still for two seconds. And you, sir, I have beef with you. You think that's gonna do something to me? Come out. Don't kill me again. See, I'm being cautious this time. That's the thing that can one-shot me. You know what? Screw it. Hey, 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 hey!
Yeah. That's right. Die before your master. I'm sorry, I'm never gonna say that again. Karma's gonna come back and bite me in the butt. Beast Roar, that's where you get that. It's like an arcane tool. Not fun. I mean, it's better if you have the Beast Embracer. And by killing these guys, uh, they throw Molotovs at you, so by killing those, I'm technically saving my life in the future. Because I'll be running through that area. Careful, because there are traps around at every corner. They can one-shot you. If you don't know what these blue elixirs are, they turn... That scared me. They turned you... They, they turned you invisible. So you can sneak past enemies. But you have to be walking like this. You can't be... You can't be jogging or running. You have to literally walk by them. And it has to be a, at a good enough distance, otherwise they will spot you. It's good enough to get behind hunters. That buddy's getting a little close to hitting me with a Molotov. Bam. I still hear more down there, but I can't see him. So, when you do that, you're free. You're saving yourself from being burnt or being hit by a Molotov. And now I will go back around. Uh, I just got that item. Oh, there's a guy right there. I didn't know that. These blood pellets, that's good, useful. I gotta start exploring in this area more often in my other save. Because in that other save, I fly through everything. What the heck? Where did my weapon go? Yeah, there you go. For once, I got a freaking parry in this area. Nothing in here. Okay. Come on, one at a time. Okay. That guy literally saw me, and he just chose to walk away. Yes, this is just, this is just the England Forest drunk on Friday. I swear. Now, do I want to drop down there? There's a crow down there. Screw it, I'll do it. What I did was very, very dangerous. But it was not really worth it. So I'm not at the area yet. That's get, that gets poisonous. The next guys can deal poison damage, but that's not the area I'm worried about. Ooh! I'm close to that area, but I still have to run through the lava pit. Not the lava pit. There's no lava pit. Um, I still have to run through everything. You know, I, I don't know what to call it. Anything in here? Yes. Pungent blood, blood cocktail. I don't want that. Does not open from this side. What? What is this? 
since when was this here? Okay, that looks like it goes to that side. So, now that those guys are dead, I can run through here without getting smacked by Molotovs. And I can explore. These are the guys that do poison damage to you, but they're not that bad. They're a little weak. Let's see if I can... Thank you. Man, these blood vials are nice. Wait a minute, what? Ah, this is the area. Ah! Okay, this is one of the shortcuts that I entirely forgot existed. So, just, yeah, I knew, I knew it came around somewhere. I just never explored this area, so I never had any reason to look right there. Cool. I have used that shortcut before, but I completely forgot it existed. I missed an entire area, too. Oops. Okay, I'm not gonna run back, though. I mean, it could be an important item. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna run back as soon as I kill all these guys, just in case. Whoa! Holy crap! What was that? Oh, a cannon. See, I'm gonna just run into this house. You! You don't run in here! Meow. I'm the Flash. Is that really everybody in these huts? No, I heard somebody behind me. Ah, it was him. Okay. Starting to get to the poison area now, so I gotta be careful. Oh. Hi, dude. I'm so happy you did not hit me because that could have one shot of me, I think. At least that could have that could have came real close to one shot of me. S just smack. Okay, I can't knock it down apparently. Okay. Before I continue forward, there's an area that I missed entirely back here, so I'm gonna run back. Luckily there's a shortcut I can take. That'll get me back there. Now, for those of you who are wondering, no, I'm not going to kill every single enemy in the Forbidden Woods. This area is, number one, far too huge and far too deadly, okay? Literally, it's so deadly. What the heck? I thought I killed every single enemy, but apparently I did. Missed one. Okay, never mind, I missed two. Uh, didn't I kill you guys? No, I came in from the side. Okay, I forgot I died, and then came in from the side, and then, yeah, I went, yeah. Oops. But they're dead now. So the area I forgot to entirely explore was, uh, number one, I'm not gonna, this is the, this is an area I'm gonna come back to later in the game, like after the final boss in the game, main game, story, this game, story, line, and the main story. Now, are there enemy enemies? Crows. This is the area that I forgot to explore. I'm just checking, just in case. There's an item up here. Okay, that's actually pretty worth it, because that is massive arcane damage. And it looks pretty nice, too. Like, just, just look. Just, just look at it. Ooh. Sorry, I'm taking in the view, view, even though there's not much of a view. Alright, anyway. Continuing on, that's what I just came to get. It sells for, I think it's, I don't remember what it sells for, but 
a lot of outfits sell for good money. I'm just not gonna sell this one because, I mean, I could buy it again. If I really needed it, I could literally buy it again. Mmm, my choice. Do I want to sell it or do I want to keep it? I'll sell it, if I remember. Why are you moving? Okay, now I gotta be careful because in this next building, I get quite nervous with this, but this is in this building, this is where we encounter the first Medusa type man, but there's a lot of items in here that are actually useful and not crappy. Okay, he's right there. He's right there. I'm gonna let him just I'm gonna let him do his daily routine on walking. And I'll just happily backstab him later. I'm gonna backstab him first and then explore the area. See, I'm clicking R3 because I don't remember if there are other enemies in here too. Because this guy is very deadly and he can literally one-shot me. That's why I have to be careful. That's why I'm whispering because I'm nervous. Surprise, buddy. Please kill him in one shot. Okay, that killed him in one shot. That didn't kill him. That killed him. Okay, now, uh, that, there's another enemy here, I hear him, I hear him, I don't think he's on this floor though, it would be nice to see Okay, I'm not gonna worry, okay? I'm just gonna come out here. Oh, there you are. I was looking for you. Whoa. Please don't do that again, sir. Thank you for being nice. So I might not be able to get to the Shadows of Yarnum in this episode, because this is just me exploring this area. Literally, this is the biggest area to explore. In this game, this is probably one of the one of the biggest areas. I don't exactly remember what the biggest area to explore is, but always a knife. Someone, people keep saying there's a hidden boss, but there's not. Oh, I'm nervous. Oh, I'm mad nervous. Oh. What the heck? Whoa! Blimey. Don't scare me like that. On a night like this, I took you for a monster. Oh, thank the stars. You're fairly normal. Was it you who put down that awful beast? Mm-hmm. Ooh, that thing had me trembling, frozen in my boots. And then you came along. Well, oh, if you're oh. a hunter, then would you know of any safe havens? Uh... Oh, yeah, of course not. I should have known. This whole place is falling apart once again. It's the curse of Yarnum. See, I don't trust him. So I'm just gonna keep everything to myself. Isn't he the werewolf? Hang, no, 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 isn't he, no. Hang on, isn't he the werewolf? See, the only reason why I withheld the information is because he killed the, he killed the child. Oh my God, he killed the child. Dude, what? 
He killed the child. Oh, I don't know how to feel about that. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Oh, my God. He killed the child. I don't know. Do Should I kill him? I don't want to kill him because he could be stronger than me. If he's a werewolf, he annihilated me on my save. Not this save. My first save. My original save. At level 300. If this is the werewolf... Ah. Dude, do I want to attack him? Dude, but he killed a child. Hang on. Oh, you again. Mm-hmm. You find any nice, cozy places to hole up in? Should I tell him? There's nobody in Odin Chapel, so it wouldn't matter. But there... Sh mm. Oh, yeah, of course not. This whole place is... It's the curse of Yarnum. Hmm... Should I tell him? He killed... He he was literally eating a child. I caught him red-handed eating a child. If this guy is the werewolf, I'm not fighting him because he's way, way more stronger than me. Mm. You know what? I'll come back here later. I'll come back here as soon as I spend all my blood echoes. Because I'm close to the say um, I'm close to the checkpoint. Not checkpoint. The... The shortcut. So I'll I'll do I'll get the shortcut and go back to the Hunter's Dream. Okay, this is the area that, where I start speed running. Oh! Don't hit me. Okay. Guys. Okay, hang on. Before I yeah, I'm gonna spend my points and then I'm gonna. And then I'm gonna go back. I'm gonna go to Odin Chapel and see if anybody else is there. Whoa. Like, I don't know how to feel about this. I wanna kill him, but I also kinda wanna progress his story a little bit just to see what happens. I'm interested. But Eileen is at Odin Chapel. I forgot, cause <clears throat> once you kill Henrik. And if you killed Vicar Amelia, Welcome dude, home, good no, hunter. I don't, no, stand up, stand up, what stand up, stand desire? up, shut up, shut up, shut up, Very skip well. all this. Why does that keep doing that? Dude, but he killed a child. Oh, I don't know how to feel about that. Yeah, I'm gonna get my health up to 20. I'm gonna get my health up to 20. Yeah, I'm gonna leave it there. Everything else is coming up to 20. Dude. Think about it. Farewell, good hunter. He was f feeding on a child. Guys, I don't know what to do about him. I, I Should I? Should I? I'm li I literally don't know what to do about it. I need your guys' help. Help me. Do I send him to Odin Chapel? Or do I kill him right now? 240. That's good damage. Good damage. Good damage. We'll spend the rest of my uh, blood echoes on blood vials. Yes. I have plenty of quicksilver bullets. And then I'm going to spend some of my insight, actually most of my insight, at the workshop, because... Ooh, but I don't have... Mm. These are good armor, though. Ah, they are good armors. Okay, I'm not going to spend anything until I can get bloodstone chunks from that shot. Oh, yeah. The moon is close. It will be a long hunt and if the beasts loom large and threaten to crush your spirits, seek 
a holy chalice, as every hunter before you has. A holy chalice will reveal the tomb of the gods, where hunters partake in communion. Most of the holy chalices lie deep within the tomb of the gods, and the few that found their way to the surface were lost again in the hands of men. But if the old hunter tales remain true, one of the holy chalices is worshipped in the valley hamlet. Yet the town is in disarray. It was burned and abandoned for fear of the scourge. Home now only to beasts. Old Yarnum. He's talking the about Old Yarnum. place for a hunter. Wouldn't you say? say? He's talking about Old Yarnum. One of the holy chalices. A town of bees. Yeah. One of the okay. holy chalices is worth. Screw you, Gammon. Anyway. Okay. I'm gonna end it here. Um, let me. Um, yeah. I'm only ending it because of that. Hang on. First, before I end it, I'm gonna go back and I'm gonna see if I, if there is anybody in, in the Cathedral Ward. Okay. So, I want your guys' opinions on this. Everybody, stop and comment down below. On what I should do with that guy if he's the werewolf I th I'm thinking of if he's the werewolf I remember from my save that I met two years ago when I had first just bought the DLC and just gotten the holy moonlight sword tell me what to do do I send him to Odin Chapel where he can be safe there's okay yeah there's nobody here there's no, there's nobody here. Yeah, there's nobody here. So, should I send him here? Because since there's nobody here except for that thing, I don't know what that thing is. Do I send him here and kill him here? Which would probably progress his story? Or do I kill him where he is? The choice is your guys's. I'm only ending it because of that. I'm only ending it, the video here because of that. I need you guys to make that choice for me. S comment down below. Do I kill him where he stands? Because we saw him eating a child's body. He was eating a child's body. A kid's body. Think about that. He was eating a kid's body. Do I kill him? Do I execute him where he stands? I just, I would feel bad for executing him, but then again, he he's eating. He ate people. He ate three people. Two adults and a child. I could say both look like adults. I don't know. But I don't want to just execute somebody because of what of what they did. I mean, we saw him eating on the child. We caught him red-handed. So, you know what? Comment down below if you want me to progress the story and send him to Odin Chapel because I don't know what will happen or if you want me to Kill him where he stands if he is the werewolf that I'm thinking of Then he is most likely going to one shot me like literally effortlessly But I don't, I'm okay with getting one shot him because I have a hundred six a hundred sixty six um blood echoes so i'm fine with getting one shotted so let me know in the comments below uh and i will see you guys in the next one peace